Three Dallas high school seniors were hurt in an accident while headed to commencement rehearsal. There are conflicting accounts, though, tonight about how they were going, how they were driving, why they lost control, the speed. Dallas police, though, said that they were going too fast while passing an 18-wheeler on West Illinois Avenue in West Oak Cliff. Police say they then hopped the median, slammed into a light pole, but a witness tells us they were street racing another car and clipped that big rig. Fox 4 is a hit. Our visit Methodist Dallas Medical Center where the students were taken is a hit. First thing was the condition of those students. Well, Heather, all three students were taken to the hospital here. We understand the driver just got out of surgery about an hour ago. He's listed in critical condition, but we're told his two other passengers are expected to be okay. As you mentioned, all three injuries are the result of street racing. Going back and forth, back and forth. With graduation days away, they were about to start a new chapter in their lives. But this car was in and out of lanes, in and out of lanes. But for three teens, what took a matter of seconds has now rewritten the end of high school. I was about to go get my kids from school. Their friends confirmed to us who was in the Mazda. Delvin Washington and two friends, Kevin Ramos and Devin Harper. They were on their way to practice their graduation speeches and walk when witnesses say they started street racing another car. Police say both cars tried passing an 18-wheeler when Washington, the driver, lost control, hitting a curb and then a light pole. Dragging the car. Then getting dragged by a white 18-wheeler. I just screamed, called 911 to let them know some. they were hurt. All three were taken to Methodist Dallas Medical Center. Washington is the most seriously injured. Ramos is in fair condition with neck pain. And Harper is in fair condition with scrapes, bruises, and a broken leg. Brief counselors were on site at Adamson High School's graduation rehearsal, which held a joint practice with Dr. Wright Lasseter Early College High School at El Centro, where all three teens are seniors. And they're always speeding here. Just days before receiving their diploma, one final test, recovery. Now, friends tell me the, teen, the driver that the teens were racing is actually a friend of theirs in that same graduating class who was going to that same rehearsal. We understand he's being questioned by police right now, but so far, charges have not been filed. Heather? All right, so as a hit being questioned, did he stop then after the initial wreck? Yeah, he did stop. We're told, friends tell me he stopped right away, and you can actually see his yellow car just a few meters, maybe a few feet right behind the crashed car. So he did stop. As for that 18-wheeler, there are different accounts of what exactly happened. Witnesses tell us that 18-wheeler, the driver, just kept going. But so far, we haven't been able to confirm that with police. All right, and, you know, this is so hard for this class. You know, it was a, a tight group graduating. It's just so sad for them. It is very sad. You know, I talked to, talked to a close friend of these teens who actually was hanging out with them last night. He says they're about a group of 49 students. They all know, knew each other. You know, they just took their finals and they were getting ready for this big, happy graduation event. But right now, we're told many of them are in shock. Yeah, should be one of the happiest times of their lives. All right, Zahid, thank you.